is up YouTube welcome back to Bike Club Japan so I want to start off by saying sorry to you guys so I haven't been doing many uploads recently and that is because look at this fucking weather so in Japan we have a monsoon season or rainy season uh, but it usually doesn't start till the first week of June but this this year it's come three weeks early so the weather is absolutely miserable if you guys have never been to Asia, I'm, bit, well, I'm sure there's other places in the world where there is rain like this, but it is just amazing. Like it will rain non-stop for 72 hours. Literally, you wake up and it's raining, you go to bed, it's raining, you wake up the next day, it's raining again. It's just like non-stop, it's, it's absolutely mental. And uh, yeah, so due to that, I haven't been able really to get out and have some fun on the bike, which, which sucks. But um, what I will share with you is a little clip of uh, on, on Monday, uh, me and Andy and Ludo, uh, we checked the weather report and it said no rain. So we got ourselves out to this mountain road out in Shiga Prefecture and uh, we, got, we got there. There's a final kind of rest spot just before the, the nice bit of the road begins. So we stopped there for a coffee and a smoke and it started raining despite the weather forecast saying sunny day. So we were kind of really hyped up about this road. We were really looking forward to it, going for a thrash. And so we just decided, fuck it, we'll, we'll ride it even though it's raining. So I'll share that clip with you in a second. But um, I thought what I will show you, as, uh, as I've got some footage that is, is usable, is um, on that same day, on Monday, I got, well, the day before, I got my Max Lens mod for the Hero 9. And so I wanted to test that out, so I stuck that on the back of Andy's R1. And yeah, here's the video now. It's really nice looking. So the stabilization, um, both vibration and like angle, like gimbal kind of style, is really, really good. I was totally surprised. It's, it makes, makes uh, the riding look like a MotoGP video. So, for some reason the audio didn't record, it's never happened to me before with the uh, Hero 9, but I guess sometimes this kind of shit happens, so it's always good to have a backup audio device. Ah, oh, you're shitting me. But, um, yeah, so, basically we uh, headed up to this mountain road, uh, pissed about with the car, it's probably my fault actually, we probably could have got a dry lap in if I hadn't been pissing about with all my GoPros <laughs> at the parking area, but um, yeah, so we got, it's about a, I think it's like, in total it's about a 20 kilometre stretch of road, but what, the other side of the road was just absolutely, like seriously wet, so we only stuck to the uphill section, and um, yeah, so I wanted to go at the back so that I could film everyone, and uh, it was Andy leading on his R1, then Ludo on his uh, Suzuki TL, TL, yeah, TL1000S, and then me on my SV that I'm riding now. And I thought I'd be okay because I've got kind of like sports touring tyres, but L Ludo, for some reason, man, he doesn't mind. He's, he's totally cool with sliding his bike around in the wet which was freaking me out, I was just watching him thinking, oh god, oh god, he's gonna high side it, he's gonna low side it, but no, he was just, he was just cool with that. So anyway, without further ado, I'll play you that, it's only a five minute clip and it's nothing exciting, but yeah, it just shows you that, you know, if there's a bit of rain, as long as you're uh, good with your throttle and you don't go too mental into the corners, you can still ride and enjoy it. So yeah, once this video is finished, that'll be the end of the, end of the video guys, so I will see you next time. Peace.
<laughs> he did it as well. I always do that there. Good job there's nothing coming. Daddy Meaty. Oh, well, boys and girls, that was me trying not to die for a ride up a mountain in the wet. Oh, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. See you guys next time. Ciao, ciao.